Swine flu or H1N1 virus has been in the news since it first appeared this winter. And while there have been deaths and hospitalizations in all states across country, most cases have been relatively mild. Of course, some people are already dead. But of course, we have H1N1 swine flu virus vaccination is available. That's a good news. But the bad news is swine flu can still be serious and it's still widespread. With that in mind, let's do the following things for swine flu prevention. The best way to beat swine flu or H1N1 virus is to get vaccinated for H1N1 virus. If you do wear a face mask, don't reuse it. Face masks should be worn once and then thrown out. Don't count on a face mask to prevent swine flu infection. It's not clear how effective face masks are at preventing the transmission of the H1N1 or seasonal influenza viruses. The same is true for N95 respirators worn suddenly over the face as filters. Only sick people should wear a fast face mask to avoid spreading their illness if they must be in the close contact with other people. Wash your hands regularly. Cover your mouth and nose with a tissue when coughing or sneezing. Avoid touching your eyes, nose and mouth. If you have got flu-like symptoms, avoid others until you have been free of fever for 24 hours. Stay at least six feet away from people with flu-like illness. And most importantly, be fit, do exercises regularly, improve your immune system because only weak people will easily get swine flu. Do pranayama regularly, have a good diet, have a sound sleep, stay healthy.